Here we are with Mike Food uh, in the Endurance Challenge in Chile. So, hi Mike, how are you? I'm well. I'm yeah. doing really well. Yeah. Are you sure? <laughs> I think so. I think so. I'm a little tired, but overall pretty happy. Okay, so how was your race? Uh, it was it was good, obviously. I, uh, I mean, this is my first time in Chile. I was really excited just to be here and obviously wanted to, to explore the mountains around Santiago and uh, spent the first uh, third of the race with some good folks along the trail in the dark. We started at 4 a.m. and uh, yeah, I, I got lost for about 20 minutes on the trail, unfortunately, but was able to kind of come back and uh, just really enjoy it. There's some big climbs, uh, overall lots of elevation change, which I love, and beautiful scenery um, and great people along the trail, so it was a great day. So how was the transition between the night and, and the day? Uh, I was excited about it because I could see where I was running because the trails are pretty technical and lots yeah. of loose rock. So I was tripping a lot early in the morning um, and I, I got energy when, when the sun came up, absolutely. So how was your recuperation before UTMB? Uh, after UTMB? Yeah. Uh, I took some time off. I, I've only been running hard for about a few weeks now after UTMB. I needed to relax. <laughs> but I was... I had the opportunity to come to this race and I really wasn't going to pass up a chance to be in Chile. I've always wanted to come to this country, so... Oh, great. Um, so, do you think um, this is a race where more more runners uh, from other countries uh, could, could come? Could I think, think so. I mean, Santiago is a great base, uh, easy to fly into. I mean, it's, it's far from the United States or Europe, but... Uh, it, I think uh, this probably needs to be more big trail running events in South America. I mean, it's such an incredible place, and Chile seems to have a culture that really celebrates trail running. Uh, we are we are working on on that. <laughs> <laughs> so we were talking about the the race. You said that this race uh, has no comparison. So what can you tell about yeah, it? Yeah, it's. I mean, it's just obviously a different type of terrain, it's, yeah, it's dry, it's but it, it, there's lots of loose rock and so it's technical in ways, but there's also huge climbs and you get up into the snow or near the snow, so it was a mixture of a lot of different races, which I really liked. Um, it's unique. How was your time in the race? Um, like, what? how was it overall? Yeah. Oh, well, it was my first time running it. I, I, I was pretty tired to be honest. I, I never felt great all day, but I was able to climb, I think, uh, the, the uphills better than the, a few of the front guys, and that really helped. Um, so, overall, I mean, hopefully I can come back next year and compare my times. <laughs> oh, that would be great. So, thank you, and we'll be waiting for you. <laughs> Sounds good, thank you.